Welcome to another special edition of the Manatee Political Panel. I'm Humanity. Today is part two of our debate series with the leaders of New Brunswick's political parties. The topic for our discussion today is NB Power. Traditionally, NB Power has been a hot mess of political interference, high-risk expensive projects, and a massive $4.8 billion debt. So, here's today's question. How do you solve a problem like NB Power? First up, for the Liberals, Premier Brian Gallant. Uh, Gallant? No, oh, ball sacks. It's all yours, Brian. Thank you for the question, Hugh. We think the reason that NB Power is in so much financial trouble is because they have way too much money on their hands. It's confusing and stressful, and then they just end up blowing it on uranium and interest payments. So, we are freezing power rates because it will get us votes. There, I said it. And NB Power clearly doesn't need the money. I know you must be thinking, what about the billions that they owe? Well, revenue rate increases won't even touch that debt at all. Oh boy, I mean, it's like a fart in a hurricane, and they need to borrow three billion more for Mac to quack. <gasps> okay, Brian, calm down. Do your Trudeau meditation. Be the hair. Huh. Okay. Uh, next for the progressive conservatives, Blaine Higgs. Ah, uh, the problem is way too many electronics in people's houses with all the computers and this fancy internet thing. Ah, uh, in my day, we had one light bulb in the entire house that we all crowded around at nighttime to keep the devil away. We didn't have these fancy electric heaters either. Hasn't anyone heard of putting another quilt on the bed for a cheaper sake? What the heck is a heat pump anyways? I'm not sure, but it sounds... unwholesome, if you follow me. And people with their big stupid TVs really curdle my cream. In my day, we had a black and white TV with two channels, and the only on-demand video was Tommy Hunter on Thursday night. Ugh, Netflix and chill! Ah, How about praying and shivering instead? Okay, thank you. Uh, I'm supposed to remind you about your nap. Oh, right! <coughs> huh. um, what is a heat pump? A heat pump's scary! <coughs> Nighty night. Next, the NDP's Jennifer McKenzie. Okay, I'm an electrical engineer, so I actually know something about this. That said, the only thing my supporters want to hear is we are going to have a wonderful utopia of 100% green energy produced from free solar panels, magic windmills, and unicorn toots. So, I'm kind of in a no-win situation here. Thankfully, there is zero chance that I will actually have to solve this problem. So, yeah, I'm just going to pass on this question and have a glass of wine. Perfect, thank you. Now, for the Green Party, David Kuhn. NB Power needs to, uh, like, systematically reduce debt to ensure that it is in a financial position to invest in new generation and transmission infrastructure. But they also need to reduce or eliminate required future investment in generation by promoting energy conservation efforts. Uh, also... Everyone needs to, like, switch their grow lights to, like, LEDs, man! Oh, yeah! Yeah. Okay, a bit of a mixed bag there, but thank you. And, finally, Chris Austin from the People's Conspiracy Party. Let me guess what you think NB Power's biggest problem is. Too much French! Ah, too much French! Ah, I saw that coming. Okay. That concludes part two of the Leaders' Debate on the Manatee Political Panel. Please, join us again next time. I'm Hugh Manatee.